guests of the season is here to kick ass and take names. Please welcome Christopher Mintz Plus. <laughs> Absolutely. How are you? I'm doing fantastic. How are you guys doing? We're great. Oh, great. You know, first guest. It. Am I the first guest? You're the you first, first guest. Awesome. Season two. I'm honored, guys. Can well, we join here? Okay, good. I'm so excited. <laughs> so Thanks. you just uh, got back from Comic Con, right? Like last weekend? I did. It's amazing there. So what, did you see any crazy? Uh, I saw a five-year-old dressed as kick-ass, which was super sweet and endearing. Yeah. And then I saw like a 40-year-old lady that was dressed as hit girl, and and <laughs> it's like no, it's nice. But then I kind of I. I was walking, I was like, oh, I'm gonna say hello to her, and she'll be like, oh, it's Red Mist, that's gonna be cool. Yeah. I was like, great costume, and she turns, she's like, thanks, man. And it's just like, kept walking. Just man. It's like, she that's, really didn't care. That's classic she nerd really style. Care. So you play drums in a band with your friends. I do, yeah. Uh, it's young called the Young Rapscallions. Yes. yes what yes. exactly is a Rapscallion? Uh, it's a troublemaker, I wanna oh. say. Do you guys tour? Uh, we do. We actually played New York a couple years ago, and we did like a, a East Coast thing a few months ago. Yeah, I yeah. actually saw you at Bonnaroo. Were you playing there? I was not, but I just go for fun because Bonnaroo is a fantastic place to go. It's so fun. Yeah. And we met. Wait, well, wait. It, I'm not so much as I drove past you on a golf cart and was just so like, were you on a golf cart? And were you, you on a golf were cart just like, all right. What night was it? I, I think it was like I think it was Friday, like Paul McCartney night. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I was. Uh, I probably don't remember that. Oh. <laughs> because it was so long ago. Because it was yes, so it was long so, ago. It was, yeah. um, <laughs> if it would have been Saturday, possibly you would have remembered. I would have been totally. Yeah. Totally yeah. yeah. It's. Fun. Did you see any weird stuff there? No, not really. Everyone's so friendly there. It's such a positive it's the, vibe. It's crazy. I. Yeah. I stepped on a girl's face when and I was she's walking. Like, Thank you. She, yeah. she literally was just like, it's cool. It's just my face. <laughs> so in Kickass Two. Yes. You play a supervillain so badass. I do. You're named the mother. We could say that. That is the name. The mother. <laughs> that is. I'm not just saying. That is the name. That's the name. The mother. Just yeah. Say it. Yeah. I have to say the mother. <laughs> so I assume this is a children's movie. It is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I play the mother. It's just a really dark, sadistic, uh, crazy villain. Wow. That outfit was. That is sadistic. Terrible to wear. How was the mask? Thing. Uh, it, it looks amazing, but it's yeah. just kind of like you wear it for two hours and it puts like an indentation in your forehead. Yeah. So it's like a permanent headache. It really messes with your T-zone. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, we have some favorite supervillains. Okay. Yeah. All right, so we want you to take a look at them and see if you can guess what are their superpowers. Okay. First up is Louis the Lilac from Batman. <laughs> That's a villain? Um, yeah. He it's a guy I want to hang out with. Yeah. <laughs> it's very dapper. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Looks like he's celebrating the birth of his grandchild. It is, uh, man. So you're all right. Like, <laughs> what what uh, do you think he does to subdue his enemies? I feel like he's just got like a lot of charm and a lot of charisma and a lot. He's like very suave. See, that would make sense. He just hypnotizes people with a little flower he has really? on his jacket. So the cigar is for nothing? That is That's really. Right. He loses yeah. him with this and just. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, because you know how evil flowers are. Yeah. So. <laughs> all right, this next guy is Fabulous Frogman. Uh, and all I can say is he's some it's, sort of gay I'm here. It's, 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 yeah, everyone yeah. knows what his power is. I'm fabulous. Be scared of me. <laughs> <laughs> I God. think he needs to put some pants on. And you can see like the guy's actual eyeballs in his exactly. mouth. Exactly, it's a suit. He's not even yeah. a real like mutant frog. He's it just a guy like, yeah. wearing his dad's frog suit. <laughs> yeah. What does superhuman power be? Well, it's uh, his special skill is his superhuman leaping ability. <laughs> Uh, he just little... has those Nickelodeon moon boots, you know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, he has what he on has. the bottom he has of his shoes. shoes. Here's our last one. This guy is called the leader. Um, I dated a guy who looked like him once. His superpower was falling asleep uh, right after he had sex. And then you, oh yeah. And the then, leader, he'll never let you finish. <laughs> <laughs> and then you would fall asleep on his forehead. Yeah. Because you could fit, yeah. It's, it was like a pillow. Yeah, um, yeah. Uh, he's just really smart because he's got a giant brain. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good guess. Mm -hmm. He actually possesses superhuman intelligence. There you go. Unlike my ex. So. Yeah. I'm, I'm over it though. I've moved on. Yeah, Let's clearly you have. <laughs> Fun. Yeah. That was easy, nice guys. Work. Yeah. Well you I like that. Christopher, thank you so of much course. for stopping by. Thanks you can for see Christopher me. in Kick Ass 2 in theaters on August 16th. Be sure to check out.